Okay, y'all, before we hop into today's video, I wanted to introduce Lena. She is the clothing line owner. She has designed this brand. It is called I Dream I Go. And she is truly overcoming adversity after being in a terrible car accident and being paralyzed and teaching herself how to walk again. Not only is she a fashion designer, she's also a singer, and she's probably one of the funniest people I have ever met. She is such a kind person, and she truly wants to make a difference in the disability community. She is also an incredibly strong advocate for the disability community. She has taken to the news to make her school more accessible and even her apartment complex. She truly does fight for what she believes in, and I am so proud to be a part of this her photo shoot campaign. Good morning, everyone. I am half kind of dressed right now. I'm, I had to run out to Walgreens because I um, didn't like the foundation I had and I wanted it to look nice. And basically I've been meaning to get foundation but I've been wearing my tinted sunscreen. But I wanted to get like a better foundation because I've been needing one. And this is what I usually wear, but it gets sometimes kind of splotchy. And I don't want to be looking busted. So I ran out and got some, got some new foundation. I usually wear this shade, but because of how like sick I am, I've been getting really kind of like gross looking from the malnutrition. Um, so I've been self tanning a lot. And you guys are like, oh my God, self tanning. Well, yeah, I do it. I don't know. I like it. I think I look better, but obviously I wash my face. So my face gets weird looking. Um, so I got the shade to match everything else, which is like this one that looks really dark on camera. Good Lord. We'll hope. So I'm applying the heat protectant to my hair and I'm almost out of it. So that's fun. I have like that much left. So I'm going to like, I might need to open it. But I'm straightening my hair for the first time in a long time. I really haven't straightened my hair in like like actually put the hot plates on it like in a year. Like I've curled it occasionally. I blow dry it a lot. Um, I do work with some heat tools, but nothing like a straightener and straightening hair is like really tedious and it's just, at least my hair. And so I blow dried it last night. So that's gonna help get her nice and smooth. Um, I'm working with the first layer right now. So I'm making sure she's loaded up with heat protectant. And I'm gonna do like 340 for the heat. I'm not going above that. So, yeah. two different sets of lashes i really like these because they have such a good curl to them and they like kind of mimic a lash extension and that's the brand i got in these but they're just too much and so i'm hoping that these won't like these won't look like these i hope i didn't just like do you see how much that is so i'm hoping these are a little different <laughs> unless i accidentally just bought the same pair and then i'm gonna return them oh god that hurt okay I don't think they are. I don't know, they look different to me. I 
and it says the salon extension look. So we'll see. We'll see how these look. I feel like a little naked roll, a little naked mole rat now, because I have all this intense makeup on. I haven't worn this much makeup in a long time. Okay, now these look different. See, they look a lot more delicate. Okay. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. Okay, and I got my little scissors to cut them because I lost my other ones and I had to use my kitchen scissors and I feel like I thought I was gonna screw it up. I think I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna wear, I just realized that the restaurant we're going to tonight for dinner is not the restaurant that I, like I forgot where we were going. And so where we're going at night is really fancy. I haven't been there in a long time for dinner. We used to go there for like every anniversary of ours and it's called Red Rock. Um, and I actually have this like black dress I'm gonna wear. So I'm gonna wear that today. But it's just way too hot outside to be wearing pants today. And like a full on sweater. For me at least. I don't, I get too hot. Ugh. Which I'm glad this shoot is inside from what I think I've been told. If it's outside, it's fine. I'm just gonna like drink a lot of water. Okay, I'm having issues getting these scissors out. got to get to this place really, really fast. Okay. Okay. And this is the right eye. Okay. Let me get the glue. It comes with glue, but I'm gonna use the glue I like because I have sensitive eyes. I'm not wanting those things to water. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut on this side of the knot. Okay, I'm gonna cut right there. That much off. Okay. Yeah, that's a lot better, actually. Okay, that's a lot, a lot better. All right. Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. Okay, y'all go show lena's clothing line some love on instagram i dream dot i go or you can go to her website to purchase some of her clothing to show her some love i dream i go dot com and the clothes are so awesome i absolutely love them it goes from um tops to bottoms it goes to crew necks sweatpants beanies you name it she even has sports bras and some biker shorts and she even has a kids section. Her clothing line is all about overcoming adversity. Oh, there's Lola, you can see her meme mug in it. There's even a short little music video. I absolutely love it. And you can read her meet the owner message. And she's just an incredible person. Y'all need to go follow her.